a top five points in the paint team. Came in fifth in the NBA at over 54 a game. Bancaro, series of moves, and Pokashevsky was waiting for the shot, but it caroms out for an open three. Need to make those attacks downhill. There's a block inside by Bull Bull. He's got a couple on the night. No look pass. Houston and Pokashevsky able to recover, and he pinned it on the backboard. Into this Thunder team, we're now down by just one. And Caro on the drive. The dish and the block from behind by Pokashevsky, and it squirts out to man. Getting downhill and finishing with his size at the rim. Boy, Josh Giddy putting together a nice little night. Brown can't finish a tough reverse. Gets it back, and it is turned back. Here's Gordon in the open floor. Gordon to the rack, extends, denied. Pokashevsky. Here comes the trailing Baisley. This is going to be tough. Point four tenths of a second, man. You've got to like throw it up there. And Portis caught it. I don't know if it would have counted had it not been blocked by Pokashevsky until it gets way too egregious. But there was nothing egregious about that. Yeah, absolutely. Oh, and Grayson Allen just no space whatsoever. And off that 39-point game against Milwaukee, the second most of his career. As Coloco got rejected initially by Pokashevsky, but stayed with it. I mean, he's a seven-footer who can get the basketball and go coast to coast. That's a problem. Well, he's making that routine and a block on the weak side. Coming over to send it back on Ananobi. You know, to tonight's OU Health coach's corner and early on. Michael was the Thunder turning the ball over, playing into that Toronto defense. It led to some early turnovers. A couple of rebounds, just played real quality basketball here over the last couple of games. And now he's got another block from behind as he swipes it away from Ananobi. Reddish. Euro step layup blocked by Pukashevsky. There was really nothing there. He made something out of nothing. Brown tried to give it over Pokashevsky, could not. He got a fingertip on an SGA leading the league in threes made and attempted and third in the league in three-point percentage. And that 40% of their team's points. See if it translates on the offensive end. Smart goes up top. Pokashevsky got a block. And bothered the second attempt before Horford can finally cash in. Or slipping to the rim like that. Great pass by Kuz, finding a cutting Beal who comes up short. Head fake by Kuz. Denny with a nice attack, but it was blocked by Pokashevsky. Denny gets it right back. Kuzma triggers a three. Here's Barton trying to go downhill, and he's trying to challenge Pokashevsky. Giddy went up and down, had to give up possession. Conchar is blocked by Pokashevsky. I loved his defensive intensity, the ability to get shots. Now you start to see him make shots with a big block there by the block hand. Moran only Pokashevsky is back Ooh. and blocked by Pokashevsky. Grizzlies lead is eight. Morant. Big time contact. Pokashevsky dunks on the other end. Taylor Jenkins calls for time. Josh Giddy, almost 60% on corner threes this year. That's a good shot for him. And Pokashevsky. It's an opportunity for them to maybe play a, a lower intensity type of defense and try to force the Thunder to knock down open shots. Pass. But now very aggressive in this one. His scoring is way down, and Pokashevsky recovered and blocked the reverse on Gordon. Here's the Sumu again. He got to slow him down, and this time Pokashevsky. Shevsky with the block from behind and Levine's put back rolls off. By no means overwhelmed in the first quarter of the season. Lankford was overwhelmed on that shot as he got totally batted away.